hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to be showing you how to pay for international transactions using a card that i created online i once made a video showing how to create this card but the video was taken down so i just have to replace it with another okay so you go to your app store this is my app store and search for this um, flip flip app yes this is it here this is it flip by fluid coin i have mine installed on my phone already so i'll just go and open okay is requesting for passcode so i'll just use my biometrics okay this is what it looks like all right i've done the necessary registration so all you have to do is to go and register with them it's a very good and secured platform register with them once you register before you can go ahead and create a card you have to once you register you notice you'll be on tier zero so you have to upgrade to up to tier two i upgraded to tier one and when i saw the need to use card for international payment i later upgraded to tier two what the need for this um tier one upgrade you have to use your id card valid id card to upgrade for this tier one and this is your withdrawal limit for the day so just make sure you get a government approved id card all right then for this tier two you have to impute your bvn number yes you have to input your bvn once you done and it's verified you'll be able to get the card feature and here is my wallet all right and i can fund my wallet with crypto fluid coins fund from bank and all these but this one is not yet available yeah so once you want to fund from your bank account you click and this is the rate per usdt the currency used here is usdt it's a stable coin not like bitcoin that fluctuates so this usdt most of us have been hearing about it it's a very stable coin it doesn't fluctuate it's equivalent to the normal us dollar you know so if i'm to fund i can switch assets let's say i want to fund my wallet with fifty thousand naira. yes with fifty thousand naira, i should definitely you should have this fifty thousand naira in your bank account then you fund spend wallet so you just have to click and it's very easy and their payment their payment platform is very secured click to continue so you have to select your bank if your bank is not here you go here and search for your bank all right these are the banks you can pay with then you can if you have money in your wallet you can send money you can either withdraw it or send it to another person let's say you want to send five usdt which is five dollar and it's equivalent to three thousand six hundred and eighty nine naira you click on withdraw to local bank or to flip user to usd account 
is uh, bank account is coming soon and this also is coming soon so if you click to look at bank account it's going to which means you're trying to withdraw into the bank account let's click it and see the local bank account you can either choose i have my bank account here or you add a new bank account then once you're done you click continue and the funds will be credited into your local bank account okay and this is my wallet uh, my user id i can send this to a flip user to transfer funds to me all right then your card this is my card details and these are my transactions so you come here to manage your card you can freeze the card all right you can freeze the card then to fund the card you have to you need to have funds on in your wallet before you can fund the card and these are the charges to fund your card after creation costs one point five dollars to withdraw your card balance is free so you just click on agree then you hit i understand to fund your card all right so you can also withdraw this withdrawal method would go to your um it will go to your wallet then if you click on this view it's going to show you all your card details i'm not going to click on it because of security reasons so it will show you your card number the the name you use on your card and your cvv2 and the expiry date it takes a year one year this is going to expire next year so and um to create card once you click on this you can create multiple cards you click on card so to create card you can choose a theme that is the color then you can name it maybe um shopping or you can name it business all right it should be a single name once you're done amount you must have this amount to create the card so once you create the card this amount will still be credited into the card all right they won't just take your money like that once you have up to this amount in your wallet you will be able to create the card and this ten dollars ten usdt will be credited into your card it won't be taken away so you can go ahead and create i already have one card which is enough for all my dealings so that is how to create a card then these are security just go you can go through all these all right and go through all this it's a very nice app I've, I've been enjoying it and i want you to also enjoy it so you once in a while they they send message for upgrading the card or maintenance rather the same message that they are maintaining the card and you won't be able to perform some transactions within that period but once it is ready they will send you a message that you can go ahead to make necessary transactions then you come here slide if you want to save you can save in usdt right here so that is how to create a virtual dollar card for your international payment do like and share this video click the subscribe button to subscribe to my youtube channel thank you